Hey everyone, welcome to Ark Mystic Academy. So we're only doing a short video today. I have been at this for many, 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 many hours today. And I'm not going to lie, I'm almost arced out for the day. <laughs> so, we want to do a couple things today, but I'm having some issues. And first off, uh, we'll show you real quick, unless the, the issues have been corrected. I built my landscape table. And, uh... Got all the, I just dumped this stuff in here because I wanted it out of my inventory for the time being. And like you see, I made a whole bunch of those. And that stuff's not cheap. Like, as you can see, hold on. We'll show you. Uh, let's see. Landscape. I've taken most of the resources out because I ain't, uh, I don't know if I'm going to need too many more than what I've built. But, uh, I've been building, not those. Is it these? Yeah, it was these that I've been building. Uh, you know what, I, right now I honestly can't even tell you. I'm pretty sure it was those I was building. But as you can see, I've started getting ready for building my castle. And um, I discovered what you... I didn't know this because one, I'd never tried. But those two big rocks right there, you can't destroy them. They're, you can't mine them. They're they're permanent. Like, they ain't going nowhere. Which kind of messed me up because it kind of gets in the way of my plans. And uh, I built around them, which we're going to see... I haven't finished yet, but, uh, this stuff has taken me all day. Like, I mean, I've been at this for six or seven hours, pretty much nonstop, farming resources, building this up, and I've still got a whole bunch more to go, because a good chunk of this is three foundations tall, and this is the landscape blocks mod that lets you build up, and I'm actually going to build all the way out, I think. So, pretty much, I think most of this is going to be covered. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Kind of like having access to these berries right here, so I don't know if I'm going to build over there or not. But, um, yeah, so this is taking a long time. And, uh, this is where I'm going to be building my castle at, unless something weird happens. Kind of wish I'd have knew it wasn't as flat as I thought it was. I guess I just wasn't looking at it right. But anyway, and it was also going to, as a few new dinosaurs have been added. And as you can see, I was, I had, was going to summon this guy in. But it says I don't have any elf blood in my inventory, which, if you look, I have 90 elf blood right there, and, yeah, it's not showing it at all, it says zero. And what's even funnier, is you can see right here, I have 27 datura. This says I have nine, which if you come over here and look again, I've got one stack of nine and one stack of 27. Can't do nothing, like, I have no idea what's going on there. And, uh, yeah. So I can't summon either one of those. And as you can see here, let's see, no. I was even going to try to summon this guy, but, uh, yeah, once again, it, for some reason, it just says I didn't have the resources, even though I had the right numbers in there. And, um, so I was sitting here, I was actually standing up here on the, the plane here, trying to figure out what to do. And down there, if we can get the scope out again, we'll, uh, hold on, what do we got now? Not interested. Down there, right there, like you can see him at nighttime, he glows really heavy. It's a beta monkey. And he's unconscious. Don't know what knocked him out. Like I've looked, I didn't see nothing else down there, but uh I'm kinda waiting for him to wake up. We're gonna go down there and tame him up. Because I had one before and we lost it. And I want one, you know, so I figured that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna run down there and see what see what his toper is. And, uh, when he wakes up, tame him, because I, I have no idea what knocked him out. I imagine there's a titan bow or some sort down there, because, uh, they are spawning really heavy, and they do seem to spawn quite a bit pretty much anywhere. But, um, also, man, them, them lagmanites or whatever they're called, oh, there's a titan bow right there. wonder, what level are you? Level 80. Kind of curious what makes the Titan Bow a Mystic Titan Bow a Mystic Titan Bow. Let's see if we can. No, I don't want that. We want that. There we go. Let's knock this guy out. See if we can find it. Is he? No, nope, he's not out. I would use the nuke on him, but uh, I don't think there's any reason to. Pretty sure. Well, apparently you can't tame them. All right. Well, never mind then. Moving on. No idea what makes a Misty Titan Bow different than a normal Titan Bow. No clue. But, uh... Oh, 
Wrong button. Try and push one. Uh, yeah, let's go down here and tame this, uh, beta monkey. But yeah, uh, the Lagmanites. Man, you gotta be careful of them things. Like, they no longer seem to make the buzzy noise that gives them away. Plus, I had one a minute ago while I was flying on my Quetzal with resources. Appear out of nowhere, knock me out, or actually knock my Quetz out, and knock me out except for one problem. It didn't knock me or the Quetz out. My Quetz literally disappeared from underneath of me. I went falling through the sky, no quests in sight, it hit me, I disappeared, then died. Like the screen turned black, it said I was dead. I got back to base, on, I respawned, pulled out a corpse finder so I could go and find my body, hit the button, and my bag appeared right next to me. So, it apparently despawned me. So then I pulled out a pet finder, which I still got right here, number two, hit it a couple times, and nothing. Was kind of upset. Was like, well, what the heck, you know, my, my Quetzal's just gone. And then uh, I hit it again because, you know, I was running around the area where I should have had a Quetzal body laying around. Because I was trying to get my stuff off of it. And all of a sudden, it's pointing off in a direction I know I don't have no tames at. So I'll run over there. And sitting at latitude 50, longitude 50, which is the center of the map, is my Quetzal. Just standing there. Perfectly fine. Not knocked out. Nothing. What's this guy's tope rat like? Alright, he's getting ready to wake up. Good. I'm ready to be tamed. Now, I think we just gotta... Yeah. Alright. Wait, what? There's no tame... Okay, there it is. Okay, so apparently he's not... Big on the Mystic Kibble? And apparently I scared him. Well, I didn't realize they got scared. Alright, let's try crouching. See if that helps. Yeah, alright. So, he's just gonna be afraid. So let's run away for a minute. Let's... Let's save a peekaboo. Yep. Anything good in you? Nope. Actually, you know what? Nope. Yeah. Alright. Let's see if we can get this monkey to calm down for a second. Do I have any other kibble on me? Uh, Xenon, Wraith. Nope. He should be Mystic Kibble. I thought that's what I tamed him with last time. But, uh... I mean, I could be wrong. Last time it only took one, but then again, last time the monkey was a much lower level. So yeah, that's going to take a long time. So let's get some berries. Get some Majos. Give me some Majos. Everything but Majos. There's one Majo. You know, so I wish they just, like, would make the plants so that, you know, you have a Majo plant, you have a Narco plant. That way, when you wanted Majos, you just go pick Majos. You didn't get everything. Because, I mean, I'm only getting a handful of Majos here. <laughs> Alright. Majos. That's not going to be enough, but it's a good start. Oh, wow. So this guy is going to take a long time to tame. So. Yep. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. All right, I guess we'll be right back again, and then when I got this guy tamed up, we'll return. And we're back. So that took forever. I ended up having to go up to base and get some berries off of my, uh, Brano. But, uh, we got him tamed. He is pretty cute, actually. Kind of dig him. And, uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's find out what this guy does. There is a... Hmm... Let's get him unstuck. You know, it might be easier if I just... Oh, wrong button. There we go. Let's sit... Come back here. Let's set you to aggressive real quick and see what happens. Oh! He threw a blue ball at it. Oh! Come back here. Oh! 
Wow. Wow, you're a fast little monkey. Alright. Well, there you go. He does 3,000 points of damage, and he throws a, I guess, a Copa Ball for 10 points of damage? I have no idea. <laughs> Alright, let's get this guy back up to base. Whoa. Wow, dude, you you are way fast in the water. Holy crap. Well, you're not so fast in the land, are you? Wow. What? That's funny. So he is real... You know, we didn't even look at his stats. Let's look at his stats real quick. Alright. Let's see. 1,748 health. 770 stamina. That would be why he's so fast in the water. Because he's got 1,140 oxygen. So you can take him underwater. That's not bad. Uh, 175 weight. 782 melee damage. And 230 movement speed. Let's get your movement speed up just a tiny bit. Get you... Wow, you gained a lot of health. Wait, what? He had a... Did y'all see that? There was like a green ball in his back. Alright. Let's get this guy up here. And we're going to probably wrap this up as soon as we get back up to base with him. Because, like I said, I have been at this all day long. It has been a very long one. I do not want to mine any more st uh, stone and wood ever again. Like, I have farmed myself out. <laughs> Yo, Trike, what level are you? Nope. Oh, well, it does fire damage, too. Wait. You want some of this? That's what I thought. <laughs> oh, you gotta love Mew. He just blows things up, man. <laughs> It's pretty funny, I got one over here protecting my base, right there. I'll be sitting here and all of a sudden this big blue fireball goes for, or ball go rolling across and it's like, what was that? <laughs> Alright. So let's get Mew down. Let's get my monkey. Oh wow, what was that? Oh wow, he's huge. Goodness gracious. So there we go, y'all. I'm sorry this was video. It wasn't a whole lot to it, but we got our base started. We've had a bit some incidents. We've had some oddities go down. We tamed up a beta monkey that we finally got back to base. So if you like this video, hit that like button. Comment below. Let me know what you thought, what you want to see. Share this so others can find it. Subscribe if you haven't. And stay safe, have fun, and ARC is life.